Sufi Kanon here, debuting my very first character from Love Life as Nishino Maki. Last time I was cosplaying as Anzu Futaba from another famous idol team anime, but I was focusing on cosplay photo shoot. Today, I'd like to talk about a few anime has, that has idol as a team. My very first idol anime is actually Idol Master. This, okay, you can see. <laughs> Which story is about 765 Pro that was made four years ago. I'm really in love with the opening songs, such as Ready. I'm ready, I'm ready, hajime yo wa. And Chains. Chains in my world, kawaru sekai, kagayake. I'm trying to do the idol pose, but I don't know. <laughs> idol Master actually started as a rhythm game, as a rhythm game from Namco Bandai. Based on that, this anime talks about the activity of the 13 goals who aim to be popular idols. They belong to the production house named 765 Pro. The character that I like most is Nikki. I actually have certain attraction to blonde hair characters, if you realize that. <laughs> um, I like her so much that I actually like to copy how she calls the producer. Honey! Something like that. <laughs> and then, last year, another series from Idol Master was made, named Cinderella Girls. One of my cosplay idols actually cosplay a character from the series, Yingzi as Siburin, Rin Shibuya. I really love her cosplay that she actually influenced me to watch the anime. I wish that one of my cosplay can move someone that much one day. Uh, so, Cinderella girls mainly follow three girls named Rin Shibuya, Uzumaki Shimamura, and Mio Honda. They belong to another production house named 364 Pro, where there are also other girls in the same division. I still love Siburin, but I can't really decide the character that I love most from this series. As I do wish to cosplay Siburin, I also really like Anzu and Ren Ren. The song I like most from this series is the very first opening song, named Onegai Cinderella. Onegai Cinderella Right. <laughs> After Idol Master, the next one I'd like to talk about is Maji Sam Pasen Love. <laughs> I believe no Fujoshi who doesn't know this anime. I'm a Fujoshi, but I'm still very picky about liking with reverse harem anime. So this anime is called Utano Prince Sama. It's about a girl named Haruka Nanami who entered a music school. Slowly, she met a number of guys, these guys, who ended up falling for her, as suspected. And in the first season, this from the first season, she met these sound guys who at the end became a group, another group named Starish, who sang the Doki Doki Deko Wade So Senpa Sen Love. And then Senpa Sen actually means 1000. For season 2, it actually went to Maji 2000 Love, Maji Minisen Love, <laughs> something like that, okay. And of course, these are Bishonins, but the main thing that actually made me watch this series until the third season are the songs. To be exact, I'm more into the Senpai Tachi, the seniors of the main group that appeared in the second season, named Cards of Night. Aren't they so much cooler? <laughs> I really love the song Poison Kiss by Cards of Night. Rocking heart, rocking heart, something like that. And I right away did stories for them. I also came to like one of them named Ai Mikaze. I came to like um, the seiyu for Mikaze Ai named Aoi Shota. I still feel weird that he is actually a robot, but I still like him best. I used to like Jingguzi Ren, this guy. Um, when I first watched Star Wars, but after watching and listening to their songs, I come to like Tokia instead. He's voiced by Miyano Mamoru, who sang the opening songs for this series. When I was watching Gundam Double O, I realized that he, Miyano Mamoru, is actually the seiyuu of the main character, Setsuna. I'm always amazed of myself when I recognize certain seiyuu. <laughs> I like Tokia's songs such as Crystal Time, Oboete imasu ka princess, hajimete hata anohi, a very prince type song, as well as the opening song from the second season named Kanon. 
はるかな思い静寂の他で Since I'm c a l l i n g myself, it's as if the song is for me. <laughs> Both Awa Sota and Miyano Mamoru are voice actors, but they also work as singers. I did mention before that I look up to such amazing people. For a little break from my Fujoshi talk, <laughs> I'd like to mention a certain seiyu that I love the most, Yui Hori. I did mention before that she's one of the actors in Project K as Kusina Anna. But the very first anime that led me to like her is actually Fruit Basket, Furuba. I'm sure this can be nostalgic to some people, but it's one of the anime that actually made me cry. Okay, not exactly the anime, as the anime only shows half of the whole original manga, but I really like this series that even though I watched the anime, I also ended up buying the whole manga. Fruit Basket is about. Ah, uh, back to here. <laughs> It's about this girl named Toru Honda, who Yu Hori fights for. She is the she is in the same class with Yuki Soma, and later on she bumps into him and his cousin, then kill the orange haired guy. <laughs> the Soma family has a secret that some of them can become an animal when they are being hugged by the opposite sex. Like for example, Ayame here is the cat I like most. He turns into snake, and another guy. It's a guy, okay. His name is Ritsu. When a girl hugs him, he actually turns into a monkey. And there's an exception though. Kill here. He's the odd one because he turns into cat when everyone else actually turns into an animal who is part of the twelve Chinese zodiac. You already sang the ending song named Ti Sana Inori. You get. Besides fruit baskets, other anime that she's involved in that I like are Golden Time and Cross Angie. The next anime I'm going to mention will be like the main thing for today, Love Life. I'm sure everyone realized the love life hype these few years, and everyone gets new waifu. <laughs> so, Love Life School Idol Project has Honoka as the main character. She studies in this school named Otono Kizaka Gakuen, which is closing down soon. She's trying to find a way to stop her school from shutting down, and her idea was to form an idol group. Because in the story, it was a boom. She recruited her two close friends, Umi and Katari. I actually have a Katari fan here that I got when I was purchasing something. And the group just expanded, ended up with nine members, and the name is Muse. I'm actually late in joining the hub as after more than a year from the whole series, then I start having cosplay for this series. When I first uh, saw the visual, I fell for Ellie. For she's blonde, I think she looks like Miki from Idol Master. But as I carry on watching, however, the character I like most is Umi, followed by Maki, and then Ali. I'm not saying that I dislike the other members though, but these are the three members that I will cosplay in the future. I find each characters in this anime have their own characteristic, like how Nico would go Nico 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 with her smile. For Nico actually means green in Japanese, and how Kochiri is very much in love with Alpaca. The song I like most in this anime is not the opening nor the ending, but one of the insert song named Snow How Nation. They actually different costume for different songs that I do get confused about which. Costume should I cos? But currently, I'm cosing Maki with just her normal outfit when she does rehearsal with a group. And that's all I have for today. Don't forget, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Comment below for any suggestion for me, any songs, anime cosplay, and like my Facebook page at Fee Canon. See you next time, and thank you for watching. Mata ne, arigatou mitte kurete.